Here we are, another one finished, Rich. Mate, this one's been an absolute pleasure. It's been good to work on. It's yeah. uh, it's kind of a little bit sad to see it go. It is definitely. It's been here a while. But yeah, um, been here a while. It's, um, it's, the, it's finally come to the day it goes. Yeah, very interesting build this one. It wasn't a uh, cab off at all. Um, we normally don't do that. We like to um, tear them right down. But we had a bit of space while we were waiting on a, a bent chassis to get yep. fixed and stuff. So this one actually came in a, a 12th month, 1977. HJ45, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. not a 45 any, not, or not a, what is it? What's going on? Well, let's, let's start up the front. We've got the beautiful limited edition ARB ball bar up there. Yep. Um, and they just look absolutely fantastic. A brand they? new one, yeah, mate. Yeah. We, uh, you can see the uh, GME whip there. We'll go into that in a bit more detail later. Um, we've got your BF Goodriches sitting underneath it here. They're yep. only 31s and they look half decent on this. I'm also staring at some um, heavy duty steering arms yeah, on this yeah, one. Yeah, superior, superior engineering steering arms. Yep. We've got old man emu suspension underneath this with the shocks, the full kit. So um, it's two inch lift? Yeah, just a two inch lift. Yep. Yeah, yeah, just, um, just normal shackles on this one. So, and obviously the paint job. The paint job, 416. So it's true to its year. My fave. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so it's true to its year. We want it to, um, well, the client wants it to look like yeah. a, uh, a 40 series. Right. Uh, yeah, but yeah. there's a few little tricks we'll uh, show and tell in a minute. Yeah, definitely. So it's going off now. Back to New South Wales to get a custom tray built for it. So um, he's having all the batteries put in there. So we've tailed up all the wire in there. Yep. Um, ready for his dual battery systems, ready for a battery in the toolboxes. You've got the braking system for the yeah, trailer. The, the, um, we've got the, the, the trailer brakes all up the back ready to go. Um, light bars for the roof, yeah. all tailed up. Um, we've got um, work lights, the full shebang. Mate. So he is a tradie. It's not yeah. the first time we've heard this story. I bought a brand new Hilux. I'm not happy. I'm sick of returning it. That's it. Um, not the first one to say that. So he's um, he's built building what he wants to That's drive. It. And, this and, thing won't ever give up on and so this is a, a, a now a tradie shoot. And um, do you want to take a look under the bonnet? Let's go. You what have, have what have we put under here? <laughs> Oh, look at that new power plant. Mate. There she is, mate, 12HT. That's it, and because he's a tradie, he's going to be pulling all his tools in a, a tradie trailer, so... Um, the old H-motor wasn't enough no, for a tradie. So, no. this, this thing's going to be absolutely perfect for what he's going to be um, putting it through. So, yeah. It's not just the engine. No, um, no, Customer no. supplied the engine, a five-speed. That's it. You've got to have the five-speed. And um, why not while we're at it, the power steer. Power steer, big oh, one, 60 series. 60 series, yep. Oh, yeah. We've plumbed that in, and let's not forget disc brakes. We need disc brakes. That's so. It. so we've got the 80 series booster, 80 series master, and um, again, with his trailer, his trailer brakes, and the disc brakes on the front, it's just going to be absolutely perfect. And let's not forget something exciting that we do now. That's it. The wiring. Tell us about what's going on with the wiring. Full wiring loom, um, front to back, with all the bells and whistles, all the extras. Now, he's gone above and beyond with this one. He's got, he wants, he's got two sets of spot. He's there tailed up under there for when he fits They're them. They're coming along. We've got the light bar, we've got work lights, we've got yep. low water alarms here in the, yep. in the top of the radiator. A lot going on in the tray with the battery systems. Yeah, yeah and... battery systems. So we've, um, he's got power going down inside, on, uh, alongside the tunnel to the rear wall where he's gonna have his compressor and all that kind of stuff. So, so yeah. these 40 series looms are, are now all custom. Mm -hmm. So instead of just selling a H, J47 yeah. 2H loom. That's had its day and it's, yeah. yeah we, we do new ones, but then there's a questionnaire. Uh, yeah. Do you want this light? Yeah. Do you want this at the back? And, and so- extra options. If you want something extra particular- So you're not chopping into stuff. For that. Yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. So yeah, absolutely awesome. Let's Pretty exciting. It. Right, we better go inside because there's some bells and whistles. Yeah, sure. it's changed, it's changed a lot. This is it, mate. Yeah. A, let's talk about the most exciting part first. The biggest thing that we've done inside this this vehicle with yeah, the dash. It's cool. It's cool. So, yeah. gone with the HJ45 dash and in with the HJ47 dash with taco center dash J07 um, cl um, dash cluster in there. Yeah. So we've un we've unstitched um, the whole dash. Mm. Didn't weld in the taco hole. We no. picked out the whole dash no, think, yeah. of, of the original 45, and now. It's um, a 47 to go That's with the 12 yeah, HT. Yeah, yeah. That's it. And um, it gives you all the extra switches in the middle there. So we've got our, um, our spotties and stuff like that up on the top. We've got some addition. We've got your brake controller down here with um, your light bar switch and also your work lights there. So yeah, it's, it's, it's really cool. Obviously the five speed. So 
that's the full tunnel. Remember the HJ45 yes. has the full tunnel, so um, yep. that's been adapted. So that means your handbrake's still up here. Yes, that's right. Um, so custom made handbrake custom cables. Custom made handbrake cable all the way because it goes. Yep. It's much longer. Than and that. now we've done the maths, we can uh, supply yeah, them. Right, They're yeah. done now. Yeah, so that's it. yeah, there's still um, there's a few things to go when it gets home. Um, um, the the upholstery and the, the flooring. Mm. So what you will see now, um, all throughout it, even the roof, there is the car builders, the, the full premium kit. We've got it firewall, floor, two stage, back wall and the roof. Yeah. So it should um, sound and heat with these are pretty, they get pretty warm in here. Now you guys have probably noticed that the seats. So we've got 60 series turbo seats and because this is an HA45, we've got the fuel tank under the seat here. Now, that was a bit of a thing. We've had to custom make adapter plates here for the driver's seat yep. and then adapt the seat frame on the passenger side to take the bench of the 60 series. That's come up really well. Really you sit with pretty that. high and comfortable yeah, too. Yeah, no, yeah. No, really good. Our level's good. Yeah. It has to be because um, what's happening up here, we've got the, the custom console. That's it. Um, the custom console up there, we've got a, a, a lovely dimmable um, uh, light in there, interior light. We've got your UHF up in there, some pockets, and also the speakers for the stereo. And they pump, man. Yeah. That Alpine system, which we'll get onto in a minute, is absolutely They're sick, huge. Man. We first were asked to put them in the door card, but this is a, um, a, a single piece window. The window's going to come down and hit it, or we're going to have spaces this thick on the thing. Oh, they'd so. annoy you to hell because they'd be the, uh, the the speakers would be you'd be your leg rub, rubbing up against it. That's and right. Just annoy you, so. But now up there, we've also got um, carpet going over the speakers, yep. so nothing gets trapped or lost yeah, up there. Yeah. It's nice and clean inside. Just the little things you don't even see. That's right. It um, didn't have a dash pad, so no. we we put the um, parcel tray up there, yep. and he can put his notes and uh, what have you up there. That's it. And that's it. We, pretty much, we've got some tails down here. Let's not forget. So we got this is going to have a massive um, auxiliary fuel tank in the back of it. So down there, we've got the little tails for the for the fuel solenoid, um, and we've also got the the other ones here. It's fuel solenoid and the oh yeah, the aircon. He's having aircon later on. I totally forgot about that. So yeah, you're going to need aircon. Yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely. So um, it was, the cab stayed on it, but everything else was uh, uh, sandblasted, all your new weather strips, yep. door cards, everything's gone into it yep. where um, things needed replacing, that's right, that's they've right. been replaced. So this one's ready to rock. You shouldn't really forget the, uh, the stereo. The stereo. <laughs> Sticking yeah. out to that far, it's that big ISO in the middle there, but it's actually yeah, really it good. Pumps. A bit of new tech in an, in an old cruiser, and I don't mind it at all. Like um, It's not for everybody, but it's really come up really well. So um, you've got your your um, Alpine system speakers and the head unit yep. it's full media station in there like and, and in saying it's not for everybody we haven't tampered with the dash no, whatsoever the it, center it, bolt, it bolts into the original uh, mounting yep. points and the dash the center dash there has not been trimmed or cut so at it can all. always come out that's right but I dare say it won't be that's right yeah. that's right so um yeah that's pretty much it let's go outside and see um give it a little bit of a wrap up eh? yeah let's do it so this is it. I do have to mention this was a um, 1977. It had the wrong rear axle right, yeah, for the five speed, yeah. to put the um, backing plates from a 60 on. So we've um, swapped the axle out. And we don't just swap the axles out and throw the disc brakes on. We've fully rebuilt the axles. All new bearings, what, everything. All time new time. everything. So and all that's done. Uh, and there's one custom throttle cable. They do not do uh, throttle cables for a 12 HT anymore. So um, we buy a universal kit and they work really well. Um, they just need some trimming and cutting and little solderless nipples going on there. It's great, great, great It's job. in there and yeah. 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 Well, right now, um, yeah. we've got a tow truck waiting for us. That's it, so we've it's... got to load it up and um, it'll be on its way down to New South Wales. Yeah, and um, hopefully the owner's talking about, he's got some stuff up here and some uh, jobs to do in Queensland. So when he gets up here, we're gonna uh, get to revisit it Definitely. with the tray, with all kitted out. So we might do another little walk around mm -hmm. when it comes back. Cause uh, we're pretty eager to see more than Definitely. a photo. So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And if you're, um, if you're watching this on social media, don't forget we are Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and let's not forget TikTok. TikTok, love Yeah, it. yeah so um, let's load it up. Do it.